Hi, this is Zach Upton for Vegas Pro Insider Daily, and today is May the 21st. Uh, big holiday weekend coming our way. Probably mentioned that more than once as we get closer. That's just kind of what I do. So we'll, uh, we'll be talking about that as it comes along. But hey, last weekend... Had a winning weekend for our free picks. Excuse me, four and three uh, all together. So that was uh, that was good stuff. So we'll try and keep building on that for you. Uh, for those of you that like to bet these free picks, and uh, as far as my own picks, uh, the had a so-so weekend, but have come back, hit three straight MLB winners, and today I got some other plays uh, going. Uh, also, I got three MLB plays, a hockey play, and a NBA play myself personally. You can get all of my plays. You can check it out. You can not only get that, you can get uh, Wise Guy Selections. They were 3-0 and yesterday, so that, that was strong. Super Systems, uh, I think they've won three or four days in a row, so that's been very good. Plus, you can get selections from some of our top handicappers, uh, some of their best bets. All those things, plus top trends. Uh, I mean, a ton of information, all designed to help you win. $39.99 is all it's going to cost for one month of action. That's it. $39.99. Super price. Easy to digest. Uh, you keep more when you win. You lose less when you lose. It's all good because I know, as I've said before, I know you're betting other games. So we're going to try and help you with some information, okay, to help you continue to win with your selections as well. And if you're just not sure, we had a, a, quite a few people last week join us. If you're just not sure, you can sign up for $7 for seven days. That's it. $1 a day. Check it all out. Get all the information that you need. And then you can become a VPID member if that's what you choose to do. Hey, let's talk some free picks, shall we? Tonight on ESPN, the Philadelphia Phillies are at the Chicago Cubs. That's the early, uh, that's the early is the early game on ESPN. It's the only baseball game on ESPN. Uh, both these National League teams last week, uh, last night, saw their both pens struggle at the end of the games, and they gave up leads, blue saves, whatever you want to call it. Finally, Phillies hit a home run the 10th and then won the game late. Those betting baseball do not think that's going to happen again, and they have moved the total from 8 to 7.5. Now, that has a lot to do with Zach Eflin pitching, having a very good year, 289 ERA, and Jose Quintana for the Chicago Cubs. He's at 3.68, so he's had a, he hasn't been quite as effective of late, but for the most part for the season, he's kind of back to normal, actually more how he pitched with the Chicago White Sox when he was, when he was quite effective. So they're expected to keep the scores down. Um, and this one, I think both starters can go the distance, uh, not the distance. They can be very good into the seventh inning. And I think, and I think, and hope the bullpens are going to also do the job in, in this case. I'm going to call for a score of three to two or four to three. No idea who's going to win, but I will side with the under in that one. Now, uh, as far as the other game, I got I'm gonna tell you about, but I don't think I mentioned, I got five free plays for you. Before I forget, I got five of them. So um, most of them are in baseball. And uh, among them, I got the side and the total for Boston and Toronto. Now I'm going to talk about the side in this one. Now yesterday, the Red Sox, they Bomb Toronto on Victoria Day in Canada, 12 to 2. And those betting baseball are of the opinion that the Red Sox, at the very least, will win tonight's game as well. Red Sox ever up 20 cents to minus 155. I'm gonna send out Eduardo Rodriguez, the left-hander, to pitch. And uh, even though his ERA is almost five, he's got a winning record at four and two, and his last four starts, four and oh with a 3.46 ERA, as I recall. And this one, he's going to face Marcus Stroman of the Toronto Blue Jays, who's been healthy, which is a good thing for him. He's pitched well. He's got a 2.95 ERA, but he's only 1-6, and, and Toronto's only 2-8 and eight in his 10 starts. What's the problem? Well, it's not Stroman, that's for sure. His team is averaging a paltry 2.2 runs per game when he starts. That ain't going to get it done. <sighs> I'd like to make a case here for, for the Blue Jays to win this one uh, because of Stroman, but with bullpen woes uh, it's enough and the fact that they uh, the Blue Jays have lost, I think, 15 out of 19 at home 
to Boston. I think I got to go with Boston for the free play on this one. Now, as I said, you can get some more free plays. There's three other free plays at the website that you can check out. Plus, um, so do that. Become a VPID member. Sign up for our email list. Get get that going. That's at the VegasProInsiderDaily.com website. And you can follow me on Twitter as well at Vegas Pro Insider. So there you have it. There's the full package for Tuesday. Check it all out. Doug Stone for Vegas Pro Insiders Daily. As of right now, you know what? I'm out.